Hey guys, how's it going? Chess back again and welcome to the top potential and hidden gems part of FIFA 15 career mode. We had a look this afternoon at the top potential players and today in this evening's video we'll be having a look at the hidden gems. This is an article that was released on EA Sports website. I'll leave a link to it in the description down below. These are the official ratings from EA themselves for career mode for FIFA 15. Like I say, we had the top potential earlier on this afternoon so I'll leave a link to that in the bottom left hand side of your screen as an annotation. These are a quick look there at uh, that, the potential but let's have a slip a slit let's have a switch over to hidden gems there aren't as many of these as uh, as the uh, top potential and i'll move this over slightly so you can see the potential rating just about fit that in there so we'll have a quick look of course if you want to pause the video at any point and not listen to me ramble then now uh, that's fair enough that's up to you feel free to pause the video so you can have a closer look yourself but we'll go through them one by one and have a closer look at some of the players. Some I might recognise, some I might not. I haven't looked in close detail yet, to be completely honest. But we'll have a look uh, now. Starting at the top, big potential there of 28 for Callum Burton from Shrewsbury. A huge potential from uh, a really low-rated bronze of 50 in Ultimate Team turns up to a 78-rated gold player. That's really, just phenomenal. A growth of almost 30 marks. He really must be a special goalkeeper, or at least EA believe so as well. Uh, as you can see, a lot of these players, if not all of them, are 17 or 18 years old. In fact, there's a couple of 19-year-olds in there, but still very, very young players, all above 20. So these are all hidden gems. There's plenty from uh, from Italy, as you can see, Serie A, a few English clubs in there as well, and some Bundesliga as well as a couple from around the world, as you can see in the uh, the rest of the top there, we've got uh, Jose Sanhiera, or Jose Luis Sierra rather, uh, and a striker potential of 78 as well, up 25. Not quite as big as Callum Burton, but still massive growth there. And then another uh, three, a batch of three centre mids there, so you can see uh, Same Kilic, uh, Maldo and Malik Ibai from Carpi in the Italian Serie B, and uh, Bryn Morrison from, uh, from Middlesbrough, who actually I had on Football Manager on 2014 and he was fantastic for me on that so I definitely definitely can recommend you picking him up in your career mode if you want to he's got potential growth of 23 to 76 overall then you've got a couple of players from uh, from the German Bundesliga and from Chile Francisco uh, let me just move that across so you can actually see what his uh, his first name is I'm Aran Sibia, Aran Sibia, perhaps Francisco Aran Sibia from uh, CD O'Higgins in the Chilean league, and then as you've, of course, as you can see, a CDM as opposed to a CAM this time for uh, Levin Oztunali from uh, Bayer Leverkusen. Of course, Leverkusen for uh, general potential players are quite good actually, with of course players like Hume Min Sun there as well. Then uh, we move to uh, the English-speaking countries, at least for the next two, with Ben Purrington here, a left-back. 55 rated overall starting, but can get up to a 77. And, uh, of course, as you can see here, the uh, Eric Palmer-Brown from uh, from uh, Sporting Kansas City, centre-back, up 22 as well to 79. So a big growth on all of these players, to be completely honest, as you can see on the right-hand side here, all above 20. Uh, Alan Halilovic is a player that we looked at in the uh, potential ratings earlier on this afternoon. He was actually the biggest potential of all of the players on that list, and he's going to grow by 21, supposedly. Of course, all of these players could could eclipse these uh, particular markings on the right-hand side and uh, grow even bigger. We'll have to wait and see over the course of the year. Maybe you guys might want to pick some of these people up. As you can see, some uh, a batch of players here from the English leagues, Ryan Ledson, uh, Harry uh, Kiprianu, I think he's a Cypriot or Greek, I'm not sure uh, correct me in the comment section if I'm wrong then Pozo, a SS, I believe that's a support striker, I'm not sure so potentially, you know, centre forward or something like that, then uh, Deli Ali from uh, Milton Keynes Dons, or MK Dons of course beat Man United in the uh, Capital One Cup this year, and then Harry Cardwell from uh, from Reading, a striker that is highly rated in, uh, in Reading I do believe and a uh, potential rating of uh, 21 growth from him from 55 to 76, and uh, then we move back into Europe for Nicholas Senzema Nicholas Senzemba, sorry, I'm struggling with a lot of these uh, a lot of these pronunciations. Then Antonio Palumbo from Tanana in the Italian Serie B. A couple of players from the Serie B, of course. We had the one from Carpi earlier on. Big growth for them, up 21 as well. Uh, Sheffield United, Diego Del... De Girolamo, perhaps De Girolamo, De Girolamo, not really too sure how to pronounce that. Again, struggling. Then, of course, Zelalem is a player that we didn't look at the potential stars last uh, week, but a player that was highly requested. As you can see, he does have potential of 82 up from his 62 starting card, so I'd definitely check him out. Uh, Mamadou Tunkara is a striker, same with uh, Donis 
Avdijaj, Avdi, I'm not sure how to pronounce that again from the German Bundesliga. Back to Serie A and the Bundesliga again. Gianluca, oh, I'm going to have to move this across. Gianluca Waldschmidt from uh, from Eintracht Frankfurt is his striker up 20 to 79. Big growth on him. Same with uh, Federico Bonazzoli, another striker, 17 years of age, up 20 to 80. Slightly higher starting rating for him. Uh, back to Italy again for uh, Marianne Churic or Kuric from uh, from Parma, a goalkeeper, young goalkeeper, Bosnian, up 20 as well. Some really, really surprising figures here for uh, players. And then, of course, you've got the one from Chelsea, uh, Ruben Loftus-Cheek, a very, very good youngster, centre mid, up 20, supposedly, from 56 to 76. He'll definitely be staying at the club in the Chelsea career mode that starts tomorrow, and I'll be sending him out on loan. Hopefully, he can grow slightly throughout the first season. And players like Joe Morrell as well at Bristol City, very, very good youngster, and Samuel Matthews as well at Bournemouth, two very, very highly rated centre mids for you to pick up. But that's going to bring this one to a close, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Feel free to drop the video a like if you enjoyed of course these are the official figures from ea so we're guaranteed that your players will uh, potentially grow from uh, from their very very low ratings to these higher uh, right hand side here in the potential column so hopefully you guys could pick someone up on the cheap we'll have to wait and see as the year progresses but uh, if you enjoyed the video feel free to leave it a like check the uh, uh, top potential that we did earlier on this afternoon of course if uh, you've got some friends that enjoy career mode and would like to know these figures then definitely uh, show them this video so that uh, they can you know try and get some bargains of their own but best of luck in your fifa 15 career modes mine start tomorrow with the chelsea and the my player but that's all for monday thank you very much for watching guys and i'll see you next time